South Africa dominated the final badminton day here at the All Africa Games in Congo, Brazzaville, picking up three silver and three gold medals. Now their journey to the podium kicked off with a mixed doubles final as Andres Malan paired with Jennifer Fry to beat uh, Villian Fulion and Michelle Butler 21 to 17, 23 to 21. It was another all South African affair in the men's final as Jacob Malikau beat Prakash 21-17, 21-17. The day's final match was the men's final as South Africa's Andres Malan paired up with Villan Fulion to beat up the South African pair of Ali Ahmed Kateb and Abdurrahman Kashkal 21-10, 21-13. Well, this is a, a good thing for badminton in South Africa, getting some funding, getting our name out there. Um, yeah, it's going good. We try to be the best, but um, it's always tough playing all these teammates. Um, but yeah. We, we just play hard, hope for the best. Opponents were good, we played them um, earlier in the week also. They gave us a bit of a runner for our money, but I think today we played our best game, we finished strong and I think we did well. Oh, so much, eh? winning gold for Team South Africa is, is always a goal of ours. But um, also for Olympic preparation, it's very important, so we're very happy. The South African head coach says he's very happy with his side's performance here in Congo, Brazzaville, which also helps him prepare for the Olympic qualifiers. Yeah, the men, they are, they are trying to qualify for Olympics, so they are training, I think, more than the others. Um, Jacob is training in China for that, so you know, they are sharp and uh, it was very good that they won the games. It's still, it's not easy, um, but it was, uh, today it was a good game. So six medals on the final day will not only send a big statement to the rest of the continent, it also will go a long way in developing badminton in South Africa. Reporting from the Revolution Complex here in Congo, Brazzaville, I'm Andrew Kabora for Supersport Blitz.